More than 100 million cans of Red Bull are consumed worldwide every day. Its unique flavor, the bubbling explosion in your mouth, and that jolt of energy that wakes up even the most tired person have made it the most popular energy drink on the planet. But how is it actually produced? Is it true that its secret formula is full of hidden chemicals and additives? Today, we'll travel directly to Austria, home of the world's largest Red Bull factory, where more than 7 billion cans are produced annually, ready to be consumed in over 170 countries. Get ready, because you're about to discover how Red Bull is mass-produced. Let's begin. Step 1. The Base Ingredient It all starts with the most important ingredient in every can of Red Bull – water. This liquid makes up almost 90% of the final drink, and its quality is critical to everything else. The water used is not just any water. It comes from exclusive underground reserves selected by the company, known for their natural purity and mineral balance. Capturing systems extract more than a million liters every day, which travel to the plant through a large network of pipes. Once at the factory, the fresh water is stored in giant stainless steel tanks and then pumped directly to the purification area. Here, it undergoes an extreme process. Several stages of ultra-fine filtration, sterilization with ultraviolet light, and checks that eliminate microscopic particles and bacteria. The goal is simple to guarantee absolute purity before it is combined with the secret formula that brings Red Bull to life. But that's not all. After purification, each batch of water is analyzed in laboratories where specialized technicians measure the exact pH, its mineral balance, and even the presence of traces invisible to the naked eye. Only if it passes all the tests is it given the green light to become the heart of the world's most famous energy drink. Step 2. The Secret Formula with the water purified and ready, the moment everyone has been waiting for arrives. The mixing of the secret formula. This is where that simple, transparent liquid is transformed into the authentic Red Bull that millions of people consume worldwide. Thousands of tons of pure water are transported to giant stainless steel tanks where automated dosing systems add the key ingredients with surgical precision. Refined sugar, caffeine, aromatic extracts, and taurine. Taurine is the star component that provides that characteristic energy boost, or as the famous slogan says, the ingredient that gives you wings. In addition, carefully selected B vitamins, acidity regulators, and flavor enhancers are added to give the drink its delicious and balanced taste. The precision is surgical. Operators, with the help of digital systems, calculate every last drop of each component. An excess of sugar, a caffeine error, or a taurine imbalance could ruin millions of cans in a matter of seconds. Finally, powerful industrial agitators blend all the components to achieve a brilliant, sweet, and energy-packed liquid, the purest essence of Red Bull. With this, you've just discovered how the most valuable base of the drink is produced, a secret formula that only an exclusive number of people in the world know completely, and which is now ready for the next step in its great transformation. Step 3. Carbonation and Final Mixture A Red Bull would never be the same without that distinctive bubbly fizz. With the base formula ready, the thousands of liters of liquid pass directly to giant carbonation tanks, where high-pressure machines inject carbon dioxide with surgical precision. This gas not only creates the bubbles that burst in your mouth, but also acts as a natural preservative, ensuring that each can stays fresh for months or even years. There is no room for error here. Too much gas would make it strong and unpleasant, too little, and it would lose the refreshing spark that makes it unique. That's why the entire process is regulated to the millimeter by specialized technicians, precision sensors, and automated systems that monitor every detail in real time. Meanwhile, industrial agitators keep the mixture in constant motion so that the sugar, caffeine, taurine, and the rest of the secret formula perfectly integrate with the water and gas. The result is a golden, brilliant liquid loaded with bubbles, ready to be packaged and transformed into the Red Bull that reaches your hands. Step 4. Can Creation and Design Before the bubbly liquid can be packaged, the container that makes it recognizable anywhere in the world must be manufactured, the aluminum can. It all starts with enormous coils of aluminum that unroll into large industrial presses. These machines cut and mold the metal at high speed, giving a cylindrical shape to millions of cans per minute. Once molded, the cans pass through giant industrial ovens, 
where heat gives them firmness and hardness, making them ready to withstand gas pressure without ever losing their perfect shape. Then comes the key moment. High-precision printing machines stamp the iconic Red Bull logo, along with its metallic blue and silver colors, forever branding the aluminum with the identity that makes it recognizable worldwide. To give you an idea, a single Red Bull plant can produce more than 20,000 cans per minute, a truly impressive number. But that's not all. Before being filled, each can passes through powerful jets of pressurized water that clean it completely. Inside, it receives a total disinfection, along with an invisible protective layer that insulates it from the metal, ensuring that the flavor remains pure and nothing alters its quality. The result is a shiny, attractive, and resistant metal container, ready to receive the planet's most famous energy drink inside. Step 5. Filling and Sealing With everything ready, one of the most spectacular moments of production arrives. The golden, bubbly liquid travels through stainless steel pipes to gigantic packaging lines capable of filling more than a thousand cans per minute. In just a fraction of a second, each empty container is positioned under the filling nozzles, receives the exact dose of Red Bull, and immediately moves to the airtight sealing system. There, a metal disc places and presses the lid with such precision that it prevents a single bubble of carbon dioxide from escaping. The entire process is fully automated and happens at a brutal speed. An endless conveyor belt transports thousands of perfectly aligned cans like a constant river of aluminum in motion. As they move, laser sensors and artificial vision systems perform a first check, verifying the exact fill level, internal pressure, and that each can has been perfectly sealed. After this phase, the cans are ready to face the most demanding test of the entire production. Step 6. Quality Control It's not enough to fill and seal thousands of cans. Each one must comply with the brand's strict standards. The thousands of cans move to the final control area. As they travel on the conveyor belt, state-of-the-art sensors and X-ray systems scan each container again in search of defects impossible to detect with the naked eye. Micro fissures in the aluminum, imperfect seals, or minimal variations in weight. In parallel, random batches are selected and sent to the laboratory. There, specialized technicians perform exhaustive analyses that evaluate everything from the exact content of caffeine and sugar to the acidity the proportion of bubbles, and the final balance of the flavor. The goal is simple but demanding, that every Red Bull on the planet is identical, no matter if it was produced in Mexico, Japan, or Austria. Only after passing this extreme control are the cans authorized to continue to the last step of the entire process. Step 7. Packaging and Final Distribution With quality control passed, the Red Bull cans reach the final leg of their journey. At top speed, automatic packaging machines group the cans into packs of 6, 12, or 24 units, depending on the commercial destination. Then, robotic arms place them in cardboard trays and secure them with a plastic wrap that adjusts instantly, leaving each pack firm and ready for transport. Finally, huge palletizing systems stack them in perfect towers and wrap them with protective film to ensure they don't move a millimeter during transport. In a matter of minutes, tens of thousands of cans become giant blocks of aluminum and cardboard, ready to leave the factory. From there, large refrigerated trucks load the pallets and distribute them to logistical centers, supermarkets, bars, and gas stations all over the planet. And that's how that cool, bubbly Red Bull finally gets into your hands. A product so massive that it is estimated that more than a thousand cans are opened every second around the globe, ready to be enjoyed and give wings to millions of people. Finally, tell us, did you imagine this whole process? Will you still consume it after learning how it's made? Leave us your answer in the comments. And if you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss the next factory tour.